Today we are going to make very delicious Uyghur sweet dessert. Tush. Let's begin! Put the soap, soda and eggs in the dough. Don't forget to take out the weird white pieces that make the egg stink. Knead the dough until it gets firm. You will see some dry spots on it. Lightly wet the dry spots with some water. I like to use my hands. Knead the dough until it becomes smooth. When you're done, let it rest for about 10 minutes. Covered with a wet towel. Heat up the oil for frying the tush. To check the oil temperature, you could stick in your wooden chopsticks. When the oil is hot enough, you will see bubbles. Make sure that you put the oil in a deep pan. Otherwise, the pan will overflow when you fry in the tush. We need extra flour for the dough. It prevents the dough from sticking to each other. Use a rolling pin to roll the dough. Make it thin and big. I cut them in thin and long pieces. Each piece is about 5 cm. Take about one hand of cut dough, not too much. Shake off the excess flour. Fry them evenly. When they become light brown, take them out with a strainer. Make sure not to fry them too long, otherwise they will break when you press it later. Continue with the rest. Prepare the baking tray for shaping the tush. I use a non-stick baking spring. Use baking paper on the bottom of the tray. Heat up the honey and add the sugar. Keep mixing until the sugar melts with honey. The temperature of the gel is important. You can check this by sticking in the toothpick and touching it with your fingers. When you see wires between your fingers, it's ready to put evenly on the tush. Put the coated tush in the baking tray. Make your hands wet or put baking paper on top. This prevents your hands from burning. Press the tush very gently and straight down. Don't press it too hard, otherwise you will break too many pieces. When the surface of the tush is even and firm, you are done. Put it somewhere so it can cool down. This is our delicious Uyghur dessert, Tush. I hope you like this recipe. If you like this recipe, let me know by clicking the like button or leave me a comment. Subscribe to the Dolanchik channel and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any new uploads every week. Thank you again and see you next week. <laughs>